Keith Chadwick. I'm the owner and CEO of Packaging Equipment and Parts here in Sarasota, Florida. We have recently reintroduced our new website. It has some very exciting new changes. You're going to enjoy the benefits that it has in finding the parts you need for your customer to keep them up and running. We're going to show you some tips and tricks on how to navigate the website. It's simple, it's easy. So I'm going to turn you over to Ethan and he'll tell you how to use it. Here at Packaging Equipment and Parts, we've been known to have a very large collection and catalog of parts available to our customers in the packaging community. And our website now offers a bunch of really cool resources to you to hope helpfully make your purchasing process much easier. Um, our website now is actually showing stock levels and availability on all of our parts. So if you don't see it on our website, odds are we do sell it or it just hasn't been updated on our website just yet. And you can actually request a quote for it and I'll show you how to do that. And as soon as you do, it'll be available next time you try to search on our website. So go ahead and getting started. I just wanna show you how to search for a few parts. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna search for a few different bearings. I'm gonna show you two that are in stock and then one that is not in stock that you have to request a quote for. So um, you're gonna come up here to the search bar and as soon as you click on the search bar, we're gonna go ahead and type in what we're looking for. So that first part is gonna be a bearing. It's 310433. Perfect, there it is. It's this Lantec bearing here. So here's gonna be your description, your brand, and then the unit of measure. And then if you were to get any discounts, I'll show you guys that in a second, but um, based on your credentials that you're logging in, it's gonna give you different discounts. And this is what we're looking at. So here's your stock level. And then we're gonna go ahead and add this to cart. And then once we add that to cart, we're gonna just continue shopping just to add a few other things. So we're gonna add another bearing. So this bearing actually was in the recent search. So you'll be able to see all the things you've searched uh, now that we click on that. Here's the bearing. Most of our parts are gonna have pictures. We're working on getting that done as soon as possible. Um, but if you, if you need a picture of any sort, we'll try our best to get it to you. And the website should have the picture. So here is this guy and it's a Wolf Tech. It's a turntable support bearing. And these are the different model numbers that are associated with it here. Looks like we have 700 of them in stock. So we can go ahead and add this one to cart as well. Let's go ahead and add like three, I don't know, add to cart. All right, and let's search for a part that we do not have in stock. So Z25-3, perfect, this one here. So you see how it said sold out on there. Um, and it's not providing a price. Um, and obviously there's no stock level, so it's not there. So you have to request a quote for this. So as soon as you request a quote, here we go. So now here is the quote. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna put your name in, your email that you want this quote request to go to. If you have any reference numbers, put it in there. Model number, serial number. And if there's any parts that you were searching for that were not on our website um, alongside this thing, you're just gonna go ahead and type in whatever that part might be. Again, odds are we sell it. It just might not be on our website. And next time uh, you come to our website, we'll have that part on there for you to request a quote on. So uh, that's how that works. And then if you have any other questions or concerns, go ahead and put that there, submit a request. As soon as you submit that thing, hopefully within the next five seconds to a minute, um, you should receive a automatic email reply and uh, just telling you that we did receive your quote. So we're gonna go ahead and go to the cart. So now in this cart, like I was saying uh, before, I wanted to show you guys as to how to get your discount if you do get a discount. So when you come into your cart here, it's not showing any discount. So when you go to checkout, it's actually gonna prompt you to log in. So this login, whenever we set up any of our accounts at Packaging Equipment and Parts, uh, we always request your accounts payable email address. And that email address is actually gonna work as an email ID that's gonna to talk to our, our system to figure out exactly what kind of a customer you are um, so to give you the correct discount. So in this case, this is the email that I have set up and then we'll sign in. And now you can see that there's actually a discount. So whenever we come in and now whenever you search along the website, you'll actually see your discount. And then when we're in the cart, we're actually gonna put in the email address that we want to send the order confirmation and tracking to. Um, and if you don't, it's just gonna to default to sending to the AP email address that's on file, and that's okay too, but it definitely is a little bit better here if you have multiple people in your company and you guys are all using this website. So put your email address in there and then put in your purchase order number. And as soon as you do that, go ahead and check out. All right, and whenever you check out, it's gonna give you a little order summary here as to uh, what you have in your cart. And then if there were any discounts, it would tell you what that discount was. So, all right, it all looks good. 
Awesome. So as soon as we continue to shipping, we do have flat rate shipping. Anything under 30 pounds is going to be this rate. And then anything above 30 pounds for your cart total is going to be a different rate. So that's what that looks like. We're going to continue to payment. And then you can pay with your credit card on file. And if you are an approved terms customer, you can select this approved terms. And then you want to just change your whatever billing address. If, if you want to use the one that's on file or, or what have you, you can uh, change that here. And then as soon as you're good, you can complete order. But if you do click approved terms and you are not an approved terms customer, the order will be put on hold and our order department will call you to your request payment so that we can proceed with your order. So as soon as you click complete order, your AP email address is gonna get a little quick confirmation um, and they're gonna get an invoice uh, relatively quickly, but uh, your order confirmation will not send to you up until about 15 to 20 minutes after you place the order, uh, because as soon as we package that box and ship it out, it is going to um, give you that notification. So again, we have a few different resources. You can actually come here to see the resources where you can request quotes, you can um, ask for order updates. If you have any issues with parts or if you want to apply for terms, you can do that here. You can also apply for terms at the bottom of the website page down here. Um, you can request invoices, whatever you need to do, you have it there. You can learn a bit more about our team. And then also we are going to be making some videos uh, for different resources for you. And then also just videos. We like to have fun. So uh, there's, we're going to hide some discount codes and things like that in these videos. So definitely stay tuned. Uh, we thank you guys so much for your business and all of your patience that, uh, that you guys have had uh, when our website's been down. Hopefully this is going to be something that you guys are going to like. And if you have any feedback, questions, or concerns, you can definitely email online at packagingparts.net and we'll field those emails um, and also, you can also always call. Uh, we always have somebody available between uh, 8 a.m. and 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and we love to talk to you guys. So uh, call that number right up there, and we will get in touch as soon as possible. Thank you, and you guys have a great day.